Good afternoon from Galaxy Campers here in Ontario, California. Today I'm going to be doing the tour of the Lance travel trailer, the 1995. So let's take a look. Okay, so we're going to start out uh, toward the front of the camper. As you can see, it's got a queen size bed, a great big window. Also, you have storage on the sides right here. It's nice little closet space to hang your clothes. And what's nice is you have this little cubby hole, little uh, countertop uh, to put some of your things. And you have plug outlets, plug outlets, cigarette lighter adapter, as well as USB charge your phone at night underneath the cabinet you have a nice long drawer it is the same on the other side Also on each side you have reading lights right here. You have one on each side. Up top you have the LED lights, also one on each side, as well as speakers that connect to the system. And you also have the uh, ventilation with fan. You have windows on both sides also. And let me just point out the screens. You have two screens here. So you have a regular screen that you can pull down or for privacy, you can actually pull down the privacy screen. And the same goes for the front window. Have your heater down there and little cubby holes for your magazines and miscellaneous items another plug outlet you can never go wrong with too many there's no such thing as too many plug outlets little clock and here's your little thermostat Big freezer. Refrigerator. Moving along, you have your Bluetooth enabled uh, solar controller up top, as well as your command center for your water pump, water heater for gas or electric. You could also um, have the indicators to show how much battery life, fresh water, how much is in your black tank and your gray tank. And you also have your light switches for your sink lights and uh, uh, your other lights. Up top is your microwave. Nice size microwave, good standard microwave. Your vent hood with the light and here's what's pretty cool about these new uh, lunch campers is this stove top it's nice and flat and it's glass so you can actually see through it so it actually kind of gives a little bit more style to open it simply fold it once fold it twice and now that exposes the uh, three burner stove and it is very easy to clean this thing just pops off and you can clean in between and it is the standard um, three burner stove underneath that you have a good size oven and below that you have your carbon monoxide uh, alarm as well as the fuse box 
that's a fuse box so you have the electrical um, fuses in there as well as the uh, breakers underneath the refrigerator you have the intake and the uh, vent for your AC slash heater okay uh, continuing on uh, next to the microwave you have more storage area more LED lights and you've got plenty of storage area up here <clears throat> there's storage over here where you can put your spices and over here is your um, other command system I guess for your radio uh, the controls for your awnings and your uh, lights and also for the slide out as well okay and right below it you got your window as well as a good size sink there, get a better view so you have a nice size sink now again another outlet and what's nice about underneath the sink is you have these little individual drawers so it makes things makes it for an easy access to your storage on the other side a little more storage for your big pots and pans and here's some of your ventilation which you can still use as storage okay now moving toward back of the trailer have a nice big storage closet room closet vacuum closet whatever you you can put a person in here <laughs> and another closet where you can hang her additional clothing winter gear And got your drawers of course each drawer locks in place and on the bottom you've got your uh, water heater easy access uh, continuing on to the uh, bathroom got a nice big wind, um, mirror here as well as your bathroom it's a dry bath so that's the advantage of the bigger campers and the uh, ball hitch campers you actually have a real bathroom as opposed to having a wet bath like you do in some of the smaller campers so nice shower so there's a lot of room again you have a standard vent with a fan and you have the skylight all right now Probably the place that you will hang out the most is this big huge dinette this is a very big dinette so you can sit in either side you'll have a great view it's a much bigger dinette than in my truck camper got a nice little Again, lights up top now here's what's nice about this with these uh, underneath the bench you have this lock you simply push it down actually I'm sorry so right now it's in the unlock position when you push it in it's in a lock position so this won't come out you press it again so that the buttons out now you can pull it out and you have all this space so what's nice about these drawers is that you don't have to reach far 
underneath. Uh, you can just pull everything out, out at once. Same thing on the other side. Right now, it is... Okay, so right now it is in the lock position. Push this so this button is out. And you are able to open it up. Of course, in addition to this queen size bed, this dinette actually uh, turns into a bed as well. This table comes down, cushions come down, and that's additional sleeping area. And I forgot one more important thing. Underneath your bed, you have additional storage. Yes, lots of storage underneath. And now that we've seen the inside of, of this trailer, let's take a walk around outside. Okay, starting from the front, you have your smart jack, as well as the uh, storage for propane tanks. Okay, there was that great big window we saw in the uh, master suite. Over on this side is the storage for the battery. And this is impressive. You've got the big storage. Oh, and what's nice about the new campers is you have this little magnetic mount. So you just throw it all the way up and it stays up. Now, what I really like about this storage, it goes far all the way back there you've got a light right here you have your table set up right here and it's a lifetime table so that's always good and you have this lock just so that this big huge drawer will be secured during transport but look at that look at all that space Moving along this side, you've got your uh, the back of your refrigerator here, so it's access for maintenance. Since this is the uh, side, the uh, side where you're gonna be hanging out the most, this is the passenger side of the trailer. You have your outlets. Okay. Nice mag wheels and some sturdy steps, not the flimsy kind. Okay, here's your ladder. Obviously, we'll bring you up to the top. And if you notice, you've got your automatic awning. And the awning starts from all the way back here in the back, going all the way toward the front so it is a very big awning all right moving on Here's the access for that heater. And here's the big slide. This is how far it does come out. This is for that great big dinette that you saw on the inside. And underneath is where your uh, dump tank and dump valves are. And you also have stabilizer jacks outside shower which I love to use it's great for on the beach you want to get the sand out before you actually go in the trailer 
this is the uh, plug that you plug in and for satellite or for regular uh, cable here's where you um, fill your fresh water tank and this is the, the uh, connection to flush your tanks moving from the slide underneath on the slide itself and underneath the dinette you have this great big storage area so that's nice okay and right here you have the option to uh, put in a generator and if you don't want a generator this could be additional storage for you but it is ready for you to have your uh, onboard generator now this is the same as the on the other side it is the uh, battery compartment so you can go with the uh, nice quality batteries and of course same thing on the uh, passenger side you have access to your um, jack controllers so that's the jack underneath and that concludes the tour of the 2020 Lance 1995 travel trailer.